but he wasn't master of the sea. His opponent was the British Admiral Horatio Nelson. Like Napoleon, Nelson was a man whose daring and skill won him rapid promotion through the ranks. Throughout 1805, Nelson chased the French fleet, finally bringing them to battle on October 21st near Cape Trafalgar. Nelson ignored the tradition of drawing alongside enemy ships to exchange broadsides. He invented a new tactic, the melee, giving his captains free reign among the French ships. In the mayhem that followed, the superior captain secured British victory. But Nelson was killed, shot by a French sniper at his moment of triumph over the French Navy. Napoleon continued to be master of land until he decided to invade Russia. The Russian campaign of 1812 ended in disaster when winter set in. Napoleon's army suffered 300,000 casualties. Most froze or starved to death. But Napoleon Bonaparte would not be finished off easily. He'd already fought more battles and won more victories than Alexander the Great, Hannibal, and Julius Caesar combined. Though he lost the Russian campaign, he would be back.